started with a nice little warm up. We are gonna go over and out to the side. So just some nice solid leg swings again. Before we start a workout, we don't wanna ever just sit and stretch. You should always sit and stretch after your workout when your muscles are nice and warm and loose. Do not ever hold a static stretch before you work out. That is a big no-no. We wanna do nice, solid movements just to get everything nice and warm. You guys, my booty is sore and it's only day two. So if you are sore as well, I'm right there with you. Good. I forgot to start my timer, so I'm gonna do that. So we don't go too crazy over, because now we're starting from scratch. <laughs> Good, let's go for three, two, one. Beautiful, same thing, other side. So when you're swinging out to the side, I don't want to see this. Our upper body stays nice and tight, and it's just that leg, and you're thinking about squeezing that glute at the top, nice little pull through those inner thighs. Woo. Yep, I'm telling you, my booty is crying. <laughs> ah, Good, it was leg day for me today as well. So that was fun. Good, three, two, one. Beautiful, what we're gonna do here is have a nice soft bend in our knees. We're gonna reach our fingertips all the way down. You're gonna touch your feet and you're gonna nice and slow Roll up. What I want you to think about doing when you drop down is not dropping forward. Knees stay still. We're pushing glutes back, full relax at the bottom. And then think about using your booty to pull you up. Push, push, push all the way down. Mind in your glutes. Squeeze those glutes to get you to the top. Very nice. Solid drop all the way to the bottom. Squeeze your glutes all the way up. Let's keep it going for a couple more. Very nice. Drop as low as you can go. Squeeze your glutes all the way up. Very nice. Let's go three more. All the way down. Squeeze to the top. Drop, squeeze, last one here. Drop all the way down nice and low. Squeeze those glutes all the way to the top. Beautiful. We're gonna bring left leg up, nice big pull. Flip it back and around, pull. Again, we're not gonna hold a stretch. We're gonna keep it moving. So we're gonna go from one leg right to the next. Nice big pull, flip it back, pull. Beautiful. I just got Sezzle set up on my website, so I'm super excited. A lot of people have been asking about payment plans, so that is now an option. I have no idea how it works or how you do it, but it is there. <laughs> so if anybody uses it, let me know how it goes. I have personally never used Sezzle or Afterpay or anything like that. But I love the option. I love that it doesn't charge you extra for using it. So that's kind of nice. So you can just choose your package that you want to do. You go to your checkout, you set up Sezzle, and then you make your payments. Like, that's kind of fun. Good, let's do two more. Other side, big pull. Flip it around and back. Nice big pull. Good, other side here, very nice. And last one, beautiful. All right, you guys, booty bands can go on. We're gonna hop right into this. Again, I'm not gonna cue breaks today, but if you need breaks, please take them. We're just gonna start off with a basic squat. So feet hip width apart. If you are a beginner and you do not know how to use a squat, how to use a squat, how to do a squat, you're gonna sit on your chair, you're gonna stand up. So make sure you have a chair nearby. Everyone else, we are going in. Five, four, three, two, one. Squat, squeeze your glutes, pull it up. Yesterday we did jumps. Today we're just going to squat. So what I want you to think about doing is pushing against your band. So there's constant tension on that band. And you're gonna put your mind in your booty. You're gonna squeeze all 
the way to the top. Easy peasy. Good. It's easy if your legs aren't sore. <laughs> Very nice. Squat it down. Push up, squeeze. Again, this is not a race. I want you to think about going slow and controlled and your mind is back here. That's the only thing we're thinking about today is our beautiful booties. Good. We're here for a little while, so get comfortable. If you have to stop and shake it out at any point, please do so. Good. Five more. Good. Four. Three. Two. One more. Beautiful. To your mat. We're going to go right into a hip thrust. So, feet flat on the floor. Fingertips can touch your heels. You're going to drive through your heels. You're going to push up. You're going to squeeze your glutes. What I want you to do is I want you to think about thrusting here and only here. So, there's a penny between your butt cheeks and you do not want it to fall out. Even when you get to the bottom, we are not completely releasing. That is how hard you are squeezing your butt. Yes? Good. You should not feel this anywhere else but your glutes and maybe a little bit in your core. Beautiful. Squeeze. We have three. Very nice. Two. Good. Last one here. Push up. Squeeze. We're going to flip it right over onto our hands and knees. What we're going to do here is we're going to extend right leg back. We're going to push up and squeeze. What I do not want to see is this. Ah, uh -uh. that looks absolutely stupid. Pull your core in nice and tight. Only glutes. This is the only thing that is moving is that one leg. The rest of your body is tight. Last one, other side. Leg back, push up, squeeze. Again, we are only doing this leg. Nothing else in our body is moving. Your core should be tight. If you cannot see yourself to see your form, then you should not be doing this workout. You should have a mirror in front of you and you should be watching your form. I know a lot of you are not. So I suggest you get a mirror. Last one, push up, squeeze. Beautiful, stand it up. Squat, three, two, one, go. Again, I'm not cueing breaks. We're here for 15 minutes today. That is nothing. You do not need a break. Good. Yes, I'm not mean. No breaks. We don't do breaks. Good. Squeeze. Squeeze. Again, if you do not have a mirror, then I suggest you move to somewhere in your house where you can see yourself or you turn me off. I know my mother is probably not using a mirror. <laughs> Good. Call you out, mom. Sorry. I'll yell at you later. Three, two, one. Beautiful. Drop it down. Hip thrust right away. Let's go. Fingertips. Constant pressure on that band. Mind in your glutes. Good. It's slow and it's controlled. Focus. Yes. Good. Squeeze. If you put your hand on your booty when it gets to the top, you should feel it so tight. Good. Very nice. We are halfway. Stay with me. Right up, right down. Let's go. Good. For those of you that are in my program, we have a glutes and abs burner after this. <laughs> Ooh, our booties are going to be sore this week, I tell ya. Ten more seconds. Stay with me. Drop. Squeeze. Let's do three more. Good. Two. Very nice. Last one. Nice and slow and controlled. Push it up. Squeeze. Right away. Hands and knees. Right leg back. Push it up. Squeeze. Woo. You feel these? Yep. Yep. 
If at any point your band is too much, please take it off. Do not screw up your form because your band is too tight. Just take off the band and do it without. That's totally okay. Three, two, one. Very nice. Other side, leg back, push up, squeeze. Belly button is in nice and tight. If you look at yourself in a mirror right now, you should not have this big round. It should be nice and flat. You should be able to balance a plate on your back while you're doing these. Good. If you need some core practice, go get a plate. Put it on your back. Balance it. Good. Last one. Let's go, guys. Stand it up. Whew. Feet hip width apart. Drop it down. Squeeze. If I can do this, every single one of you can do this. Yes, you can. I did my leg day this morning. I did my cardio this morning. I walked this morning. So do not tell me you cannot. Put 15 minutes into your body. Do not tell me you can't. Because I will tell you a straight up answer. Good. If you ever need some tough love, just send yourself my way. I'll give it to you. Good. 20 seconds. Beautiful. Squeeze those glutes. It's our last round. Make it count. Squeeze. Good. Nice and soft. Push against that band. Do not let your knees fall together. Push. Let's go for three. Let's go two. Last one here, very nice. Drop it down. Feet hip width apart. Fingertips can touch your heels. Mind in your glutes. Squeeze. Very nice. If you are wanting to focus on your glutes, this is your main concern in your body. You should be hitting glutes four to five times a week. Your glutes and your legs are probably the strongest muscles in your body. They are the toughest muscles in your body. You can push them damn hard. Upper body, not so much. You need to rest it more. Your legs though, you can push them. Good. Drop. Squeeze those glutes. And I will tell you as well, your legs will be the hardest muscles to change. Like I said yesterday, you have to give it at least a year, at least, until you start to see big changes. Good, three, good, two, very nice, last one, push up, squeeze. Let's flip it on over, you guys, we are so close to the end, don't give up yet. Right leg, back, squeeze. These hurt, these hurt. Good. If they are not hurting you, you are not squeezing your core tight enough and you are not putting it in your glutes. Good. Very nice. Let's do two. Let's go for one. Same thing, other side. Legs straight back, belly button in. Push it back, squeeze. Good. About 15 more seconds, nice and controlled. It's not a race. We should be going slow and we should be squeezing those glutes so damn hard with our minds. Get out of your head and into your body. Last one. Beautiful. We're gonna stay seated. You can go ahead and take that band off. We're gonna do a quick little stretch. Don't run away yet. Whoo! How's your booty feeling? All right, we're gonna go feet flat together, chest up, shoulders back. We're gonna drive straight down, open up those inner thighs a little bit. Oh, Friday, when Friday comes, we're gonna be all screaming because our booties are going to be crying. Good, three. Two, one, beautiful. From here, we're just gonna take that right or left leg, whichever you prefer, and then we're gonna lean straight down. So what I want you to think about doing is driving both hips to the floor. So 
Both butt cheeks are on the floor right now, and then we're leaning forward over top. Depending on your flexibility, you may be way up here, you may be way down here, so it really depends. I am a very unflexible person, as most of you know. So this is as far as I go with both my butt cheeks on the floor. Good, other side. Again, after this, please make sure you do a nice big stretch. A two minute stretch is not enough. I think it was two minutes, a minute and a half. So please make sure you do a nice big stretch after this. Roll out your glutes if you have a roller so that when Friday comes, it won't be too, too bad. And again, if you are not in one of my programs, I hope to see you in a program. You just go over onto my website. You can take a look under online programs, all the programs that are up and coming. And then again, that Sezzle option is there for those of you that asked for payments. So you can go ahead and give that a try. And again, let me know how it goes because I have never used it. Three, two, one, beautiful. That is day two, you guys. We are done. I will see you back here tomorrow. Again, I will post later today what time tomorrow, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be around the same time. And if you're watching it later, just hashtag replay below so that I know you stopped by, you did it, you loved it, you hated it. Be honest. I will talk to you all soon.